and she is supposed to know how to take care of the child. So this was one of was one of many uh, reasons that uh, men's rights movement uh, well, uh, decided to solve. The uh, men uh, started to, to uh, well see themselves not as an obvious as an obvious. Uh, uh, well, obvious participant uh, in well, history, in the social uh, history, but as uh, someone who needs to fight also for their rights. And uh, they started to fight, and uh, this created, this movement uh, was uh, followed by uh, the Men's Studies uh, movement. It is the field of study, uh, deals with uh, masculinity, men with men, men image in the uh, contemporary, contemporary world. So, uh, this is uh, the first uh, aspect of my study, the second one, mass media. So, why I decided to uh, deal with uh, men in mass media, not, uh, and, and not men in walking on the street, and uh, well, men you can see uh, every day uh, when you uh, go out. Uh, because uh, they are very, very representative. Uh, let's start with uh, this one. Uh, Japan is a very urbanized society. Uh, everybody, well, uh, and uh, if you just uh, go out, go outside, walk on, walk on the street, there are plenty of images around us. Plenty of, uh, uh, plenty of uh, advertisements. And we are influenced by this. Uh, and influenced by this, we are uh, buying. Uh, we are ten, intend to buy more. Uh, uh, the consumer uh, urban society urbanizing co uh, triggers uh, consumer. So, uh, for example, this this example example, uh, women's cosmetics market. Go to drugstore and see uh, how much, how many of them uh, we have. We have well, uh, so many, uh, so much space only for women's cosmetic, and uh, in my opinion, it is hard to maintain uh, market cosmetic men's women's cosmetic uh, companies uh, are, uh, are are in troubles uh, to maintain uh, this uh, growth of uh, their uh, growth of uh, consumer uh, consumption of their uh, products. So. They are trying to solve it, and uh, one one, uh, wh one way to solve uh, the saturation, this market saturation, is to find another uh, another field, another uh, target. Uh, uh, you can uh, they can uh, sell their products, and uh, this is perfectly uh, well, it, it, it was perfectly. Uh, sold by creating a men's cosmetic uh, market. Uh, until well, recently, there was uh, there was uh, a man, men didn't use uh, haven't used cosmetics so much, uh, but it changed. Uh, it, it, this market is growing. There is a hole, and market uh, and the cosmetic companies started to. Uh, it. So uh, they hired mass media to, pro uh, to uh, promote their products. That's why you can see more and more uh, 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 advertising com uh, companies, uh, advertising uh, uh, strategies targeted uh, and aimed uh, at men. And uh, one, one more uh, reason to deal with mass media. Uh, as I said, we are uh, surrounded by visual images, and we uh, and visual images, pictures, and uh, our movies. We don't need to speak a many languages to understand them. Uh, we don't need to speak a, a language at all to understand a picture. There are uh, well, there are language uh, in itself. And so uh, unknowingly, unknowingly, we are influenced. Uh, and we tend to, to well, maybe judge, uh, to uh, make some uh, thoughts, to stereotype just by seeing something or someone. So uh, 
the visual uh, image looks is very important in our everyday life. I wanted to uh, focus on this. Looks. Okay. Uh, body image. So we came to body image. Uh, body image. Uh, uh, well, it may seem obvious for you. It's about body, but what about body? It's about. Uh, Mm, how to put it? Uh, it is about how we see ourselves and how it, uh, this uh, thinking of our uh, influence our behavior. So, uh, for the image deals with self-esteem. If we feel we are attractive, if we feel uh, we are uh, well groomed, uh, we have good clothes, and. Uh, well, we are uh, we feel, uh, more confident, we feel more uh, attractive, more uh, assured, more secure, and uh, more courageous to, or maybe to talk to someone else. And so we are uh, we are judging uh, ourselves, and uh, we are influenced by by what we think of ourselves, and we are also. Uh, judging others by their looks, like I said before. And this can uh, cause stereotyping. We can, uh, well, don't judge a man by the way he looks, we, we, used to, we used to say, but this judging, this stereotyping is in fact very important. And we, uh, by uh, creating stereotypes, we uh, make sense of the world around us. Without that, we would be lost. We have to have uh, something to think about uh, people around us, not to go crazy with it. Uh, so we're judging others, but we, judge, we can judge positively, we can judge neutrally, we can judge in a negative way. And uh, this can cause uh, serious uh, social diseases uh, uh, by looking, by comparing ourselves with others by looking at advertisements, uh, our self-esteem can drop radically, and that's why uh, such uh, diseases, right, like eating disorders, like bulimia, anorexia, uh, are spreading. Uh, it is also uh, really, really uh, strongly uh, uh, connected with uh, depression and uh, yeah, uh, social diseases are. Uh, really uh, have a great uh, connection to uh, self-esteem and looks. So that, that's about body image. And the fourth one, cultural studies. Fourth field of study I'm doing with. Uh, in this case, I'm trying to compare and trying to maybe build some bridge between Poland and between Japan. Uh, why? Uh, why I am trying to do this? Because Look, uh, when you go abroad, <laughs> it is good to know something about where you're going. Uh, this is uh, why we're why, why probably in horizons. Uh, okay? well, uh, um, it, it should be obvious that we should learn all, all our lives, but uh, 